Hi guys, Adam here. I'm outside Old Trafford. Couple of familiar faces. Um, come to you first, Abdullah. <laughs> They're ringing the dinner bell and all sorts out here. <laughs> one one today. <laughs> what's the what's the bell, lads? Can you explain the bell? Oh, it's the it's the dilly ding dilly dong. That's what it is. <laughs> uh, one one today. Disappointing. Um, well, if this was three months ago, then I'd definitely take it. I mean, Leicester have been unbelievable. Got to give them credit for the season they've had. But um, overall, it just felt similar to Everton. Great start to the game. We've set up really well. We've attacked them from the start. We get the goal. And then it just dies out in the second half. And I really think the reason that's happened is because you've got players like Carrick and Fellaini who will have a great 45 minutes. Fellaini played to the way he plays and he was really good in the first 45 minutes. And then the second half, they just die out, their legs go. And as soon as Ranieri noticed that, he's bought on Gray for them and he's got three pretty much wingers on the pitch slope. Like, Mares and Gray, and they were just attacking us. And thank God, you know, they didn't score at the end because that would have been 2 1, win the league here, and that would have been a disaster for us. Sorry, I'm still laughing at that guy yeah. ringing his bell over there. <laughs> Yo, Yo, your man Daily Blind yeah. was absolutely superb today. I, you know what, I need to apologize to Daily. I know he watches fan cams. Daily started the season, I tore into you. What did I, say? I apologize. What did, what did I say? He said you're the best center back in the world, so, um. Yeah. I thought he was excellent there today. Carrick played in the first half like he had rear view mirrors on, in the second half like he had ice skates. But yeah, uh, well, to be honest, <laughs> it's a bit frustrating today, you know. There's a few good performance, but, performances, but it's pretty mediocre from the majority, like Rojo. I don't know I don't know what Cameron Bob Jackson has to do to play. There's Carrick and Fellini. When you, got, you can see that. Leicester play with so much energy, you need an energetic midfielder there like Schneidlin or Herrera. It's just frustrating. I feel like Lingard is just a championship player. It's so frustrating just to see him just not run out players and it's just been the story of our season, you know. Um, I'm just looking, I think top four's gone now. I think top four's gone now, unfortunately, but and we have to just look forward to the FA Cup final. It's so frustrating, but that's football, isn't it? Top four gun. Um, no, let's wait and see for the game that's being played now. City and Southampton, I think no matter how much Arsenal can battle it, no one can battle it against Aston Villa at this point. And they've got them at home at the, the end of the season. I think that if City lose today or draw and then obviously Arsenal can do a job on them at the Etihad, then maybe. But there's just a slight 20% chance that we might get it. He's still holding out hope for top four. Are you? I'm hoping, I'm hoping, but we're seven points off Arsenal, four points off City, and can you really see us winning at West Ham away, even though we've already done it? Even Norwich and Bournemouth, get, I, we're not consistent enough to win three games in a row, I don't think, but maybe, you never know. Hopefully. It's all sounding very moisy around here.